guys welcome back to my channel today i am going to be organizing underneath my kitchen sink it is like just a mess down there i have not organized it since we moved into this house so i'm really excited to show you guys how i organize it i went to tj maxx and i bought a few like organizers and little shelf things hopefully i can get under the sink like just so much better than what it is right now but yeah i will show you guys a before of what it looks like and then share with you like what I bought and what I'm gonna be using to try to organize it a little bit better. And yeah, let's just jump right into today's video. Okay, so I bought these. This is a two pack of just little white shelves. So I got that. I also got two of these corner Lazy Susans. I thought I could put one of each of these like underneath this little shelf and do it that way. I got one of these um, like long storage things. And I think both of these are actually for like pantries and fridges, but I thought they would work perfect. And then I just kind of stocked up on some stuff for underneath. So I got these like magic, it's basically like a magic eraser. I got some more sponges, a pack of the disposal cleaner, and then a big pack of our dishwasher detergent, just, just so that we can be like stocked up on that as well, cause we're almost out of those. So this is what I'm gonna be using today. I also already have some buckets down there that have some stuff in it. So I'm just gonna like reorganize all of it. So this is what it currently looks like. Like I said, it is a disaster under here. I've never even tried to organize it. And these are the buckets I have. They're ones from Grove Collaborative. So I think I have three or four of them. I have another one back there with some stuff in it. So. By just taking everything out so it's all empty now um, we have this like little shelf in there so I put our like home defense and our Clorox back there because we don't like use that a whole lot but we want to be able to get to it easy I put our like extra plastic bags right there because we use those like for the kids dirty clothes sometimes if we're like going out or just like random stuff <laughs> so I have those there and then I have all the stuff right here so I'm gonna put these shelves in here and start organizing everything. I also have this jar that I'm not using for anything right now. So I'm going to put our dishwasher like pods in here and put that on one of these shelves as well. I can't help but feeling just loving this moment. Can we stay here? So while I was organizing today, I loved how it turned out in the end and I just loved organizing it all in general. So I actually went to the store later today and I got more organizing stuff to organize the rest of the kitchen. I'm going to be doing the rest of our cabinets and our drawers as well with our silverware and our junk drawer and just get everything organized in the kitchen. So there will be more organizing videos so if that is something you guys enjoy then I hope you'll subscribe and stick around for the rest of the videos. This moment, can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment, can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment, can we stay here forever? I'm just loving this moment, can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment, can we stay here together? Stop the time, don't you know that I would
drive Do you know I'm looking? Would you stay till the morning light? Or would you follow me? Or would you let it be? If I leave tonight We could do this right We'll find the remedy Okay, so here is the end result. It is much better than what it was. So, like I said, I have those big things back there. This one right here, I have my stainless steel cleaner, um, just some bug spray in case we like see a bug or something and I can spray it really easy. We have some Goo Gone, and then we have our carpet cleaner right here. And I also have an extra hand soap back there. And then this one is stuff I use a lot. So like my thieves cleaner, which I use on the counters every single day. I have the kids high chair and toy cleaner. I have our dishwasher um, jet dry rinse aid in here. So I use that all the time too. And then I have our squirt and mop back here. And then under here are the two little corner lazy Susans. I have our refill for our thieves. And then this is, um, the Mrs. Meyer baking soda cream cleaner. I use this on our sink probably maybe once every two weeks or so. So I just have that down there. And then in here I have some gloves, a sponge. I have this toothbrush. I use this to clean my ring whenever I clean it with like my thieves cleaner. Um, a big brush. I don't know if I said that. Um, this is one of those like steel wool um, scrubber thing. And then we have some Raid um, fly ribbon for the summer because the flies get so bad here in Georgia and then over here I have this little tray with extra sponges the magic erasers and then these scrubbers I use these green scrubbers on our stainless steel dishes a lot I have our all of our dishwasher pods so this stuff is mostly like bathroom stuff. This is a daily shower spray. I don't use it a lot, but I have it in here. Um, this is a toilet bowl cleaner and then that's a glass cleaner back there. And then that's just like our window cleaner thing I stuck right there. And I also have our garbage disposal cleaners. I just set them just right there. So easy access. And then back there in the back, I have extra toilet bowl cleaner. We have a lot of those. I don't really know why we have so many, but we do. And then this is just an extra Mr. Clean multi-service cleaner. Um, whenever we first moved here in like June, this was literally the only cleaner they had in the store, I guess, due to like COVID-19 and stuff. So I just have some of that left. And then we have another, it's like the CLR cleaner way back there. We don't really use that a lot. And then under this stand, I have our trash bags. I would love to find something to hook on the door and hang our trash bags over here. But when I was at the store the other day, I couldn't find anything. So they're just right down there for now, but it's still like a lot easier to access them than it was before. But yeah, so this is the finished product. I really love how it turned out. It was really simple, a really cheap thing to do. All of the, all of the things I bought for this were under $5. The two stands and then those two, I got them at TJ Maxx for really cheap. So this is a really easy, cheap way to organize under your sink if you are looking to do that. I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little organize with me. I hope I could help give you some ideas if you're looking to organize under your kitchen sink or your bathroom sink or anywhere really. These are really easy ways to organize pretty much any cabinets, just some shelves and some storage bins. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please leave it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Subscribe if you're not already. And I'll see you guys very soon in my next video. Bye. Stay with me now till the morning light for you turn away i just want you to know that i didn't throw your stuff away